This is Jackie Boy from Desert Highways TV. I'm here with Mimsy Gleason from Trailer Trash Tattoo at Rites of Passage. Now Mimsy, you've been tattooing for how long? 16 years. Wow, 16 years, that's amazing. How did you get started? Just being obsessed with drawing and tattoos. So you came from a background of a lot of doodling through high school and whatnot? I was always that guy that was in the back of maths class drawing tattoos on people and graffitiing my uh, homework books. I can relate to that. Now, Trailer Trash Tattoo, at a glance, is not your traditional looking tattoo studio. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Uh, well, I guess that's true because sometimes I tattoo in a vintage caravan and we have a very pink, cute, vintage theme. So it's not your standard black skulls, upside down crosses type of setup. Now, uh, looking through your portfolio, I would say, I think it's safe to say that you're more of a modern, traditional kind of tattoo artist. Is that safe to say? That's true. I guess a lot of my work is almost bordering on uh, a little bit kawaii cartoony as well, but I definitely um, have my artistic roots firmly planted in um, Sailor Jerry's uh, artwork and other artwork of that American traditional era. What draw you towards that style of tattoo initially? It's just cool. It's the stuff that sailors had on them. It's bold and there's heaps of black. It's just really simple and easy to look at. I like to be able to look at something and read it from a distance. It's just easy to see and... I've got a lot of friends who are into traditional tattoos as well and one thing that they really like about them is I'm gonna get this and it's gonna last well. It's going to age well. How do you do? You think that's correct? That is true. Yes, but I love the look of vintage traditional tattoos too. They go kind of green color, and you know, I, I love looking at um, vintage tattoos actually from the era as well. I don't mind if they go a bit squishy over time. I kind of like that look. <laughs> yeah, awesome. Uh, how are you finding Rites of Passage so far? I love it. It's a great venue, which is you know, probably the most amazing thing and um, it, I think it seems like the biggest convention in Australia um, and it's in Melbourne so I love it. I'm having fun. Uh, you're uh, from Queensland is that correct? Brisbane yes. What's the tattoo culture like there in comparison to Melbourne or other parts in the world? The tattoo culture is strong and we have a lot of other cultures that are probably a little bit stronger in Brisbane than other states of Australia. Um, the custom culture scene and the car, hot rod, rockabilly scene is really big. I think it's because of the weather. Uh, people get out with their cars and the tattoo culture goes along with that. So it is a little bit different. Um, how do you think your style is different and how it's changed from the original traditional tattoo style, inks, colours and techniques? Uh, well, the traditional tattoo style was probably bound by what was available at the time. So back in the day, 50 years ago, it was probably quite hard to get a lot of colours and the pigments had to be hand blended to make the ink. Whereas nowadays there's tens of thousands of tattoo companies available at your fingertips online in a whole myriad of colours. So the style has changed a lot and the, the colour quality has changed a lot um, over the years due to the refined techniques of making the ink. So yeah, it's definitely quite different to back then. Awesome, well hey, thanks a lot for your time today, Mimsy. Hi, I'm Mimsy Gleason from Trailer Trash Tattoo in Brisbane, Queensland, and I'm coming at you from the Melbourne Tattoo Convention for Desert Highways.